Good morning. Uh, it's Saturday, the 7th, and uh, this morning I will be moving to Gettysburg. It's uh, a bittersweet morning um, here at Starbucks with uh, my coffee and the Word of God. Um, I was just reading uh, in the Minor Prophets, uh, and it was in uh, Zechariah 8, reminding me a little bit of uh, just the significance and, and sort of my prayer for, uh, for this big transition. Uh, in chapter 8 it says, uh, verse 20, Thus says the Lord of hosts, it will be, at be that peoples will come, even the inhabitants of many cities. The inhabitants of one will go to another, saying, Let us go at once to entreat the favor of the Lord, and to seek the Lord of hosts. I will also go. So many peoples and mighty nations will come to seek the Lord of hosts in Jerusalem, and to entreat the favor of the Lord. Thus says the Lord of hosts, In those days ten men from all the nations will grasp the garment of a Jew, saying, Let us go with you. We have heard that God is with you. I think that's uh, fulfilled in Christ that just this blessing that people are seeking the Lord, uh, grabbing hold and saying, Oh, we heard that God is with you. We heard about this news, this hope of reconciliation, of being forgiven by God. We've heard of the cross. We want to hear uh, this good news of Jesus. That's really my prayer um, as I'm uh, going out to the campus and, and uh, proclaiming the gospel my prayer that, that God would just work in the hearts of people, um, that they would want to hear the gospel, that God would just do a work, uh, that all the nations would stream uh, to the Lord in these last days. Uh, so it's, it's bittersweet uh, leaving uh, here in State College, but yet there's this mission that God has called me to. Uh, they're at Gettysburg and Shippensburg, and I'm eager, so eager to do that. So thank you for your prayers. Um, God has provided a place in Gettysburg for me to live. I'm moving there today. Um, please continue to pray. Pray uh, just for today with the, with the move, all the details. Um, and pray that God really would you know, cause uh, Zechariah 8 to be fulfilled. Um, that his mission would go forth, that he would proclaim his glory among the nations. And that as we and the sub makers reach the campus, that uh, we would really be able to reach the world for the glory of Christ. Thank you.